hot, ha. Huh? Outside today. My God. Y'all, it is Saturday. Thank you, Lord. I got up this morning and uh, I woke up this morning and I said, girl, you gonna work out. Girl, you gonna work out. Girl, you gonna work, just work on your ass and your glutes. You know what I mean? It's summertime. It's summertime. Now, my stomach is not big or anything. Let me just get, let me show you. I'm not big, okay? I'm not big, hold on. Not big. Hold on. Right? I'm not big, right? Y'all put in the comments, she not big. But I do feel like I mean, I mean, y'all see it, y'all see it, y'all see it. Those, those computers working in tech, y'all know? Looking like she finna. But anyway, I still think I need to like lose a little bit though. Cause I feel like now that I'm not using my arms, it's getting flabby. I don't like that. I don't like that. Uh-uh. So let's walk down these steps with my little funky attitude because I don't want to work out. Look who's decided to sit in my seat. Miss Ma'am. Sky, what's going on? Girl, yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, let's do it. Okay, let's go get dressed. That's all I needed for today. Let's go get dressed. Okay, so my agenda for today, I'm going to my best friend's graduation party. My best friend graduated from Penn State with a degree in law, so she's completed she has completed law school which is so awesome and today is her graduation party so she told us that we have to wear cocktail attire now listen i, I don't really feel like wearing no dresses babe i don't feel like wearing no dress and then she's um her pool is open as well so um so we're bringing our swimsuits and all that but um it's kind of rainy like on and off so hopefully the sun does come back out I'm pretty sure it will. It's been like back and forth, like rain, sun, rain, sun all day today. But anyways, this is what I'm wearing. Um, I mean, it's kind of like um, cocktail hour-ish, you know? It's a little uh, two-piece. I got it from Shein. And then I'm gonna wear these. Uh, these are new, I never wore these before, but hopefully it's comfortable. I'll probably bring some flats or something just in case. But, all right, it's time to get dressed. Let's do it.
given summertime fine. Oh, look at my shoes. Hurry. It hurt, y'all. I ain't gonna hold you. It hurt. These joints hurt. It hurt, okay? It hurt. All right, y'all, let me know. Is it giving cocktail? Hold on, let me turn it this way. Is it giving cocktail party? Cocktail, like, I don't know. Hold on, y'all. Bear with me. Is it giving cocktail? Cocktail party? I got the... Oh, y'all can't see. Hold on. Ooh. They hurt, y'all. These shoes hurt real bad. It's not super uncomfortable because it's like, you know, but my ankle's already screaming. Oh, Lord. Okay. Well, hopefully this outfit passed because my best friend definitely was like make sure you're cute and like dressy because we're taking pictures and i have a photographer and then all that stuff but i didn't have to bring my swimsuit probably won't go in the pool like i'm wearing shorts so i really don't have to Ooh, my perfume got smoothed in okay so i'm starving I'm late, but I'm about to make a little healthy salad real quick. Whew. Let's do it. So hungry oh my stomach but I'm gonna eat this salad real quick at least I have something on my stomach and then when I get there baby she finna crush I hope she got some good food but no she bestie she 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 got good food I'm excited I'm supposed to be there at 5 y'all it is 4 45 and it's like a 45 minute drive so she gonna be uh wondering where I'm at. But it's not cool to show up to the party when it first starts. Yeah, so normally I am there like before anyone gets there because I don't like to go somewhere and like the house is crowded with people. Like, I don't know what to say. I don't know where to sit, where to stand, what to do. But this is Bestie, so she was like, don't worry, Bestie. I'm gonna take you everywhere I go. Mm-hmm. that we have seen you went through because we was going with it with you and i am glad it is over with and we are proud of you and all i can say is i seen it when you was a baby you keep grinding thank you for being uh, my daughter i'm so proud of you oh. Oh. let me tell you so let me tell you so Oh no, I need to close this. When I say it is freaking hot in my house, y'all. So I had a gas leak that happened like a month ago. And I had called the emergency uh, number for the gas company. They came out and said, yeah, your union is leaking gas. They need to come and like tighten it up. They turned everything off. They shut off my gas. They were like, yeah, it's just for your heater. They said that um, the AC was fine. I don't even know how that worked, honestly. Or if it's like the same thing. I don't freaking know. But anyway, they turned it off. And now I'm like, oh, it's getting hot. Let me turn on my AC. Because he said it's fine. And the freaking thing is like shut off. And there's no way I could turn it on because they have to come out and like turn it on. 
So all morning, I've been calling different HVAC companies so they could come in and do the maintenance. And um, the, the company that installed everything in my house, because my house is like four years old, so it's pretty new. And I had called them and they were like, oh, I'm so sorry, we no longer service your area. So I'm like, dang, who to call? I'm annoyed because first of all, it's expensive for them to even come out. And then if I get multiple like estimates and all of that, that means I gotta pay for all these companies to come out. I might as well just, you know, let me not. So I'm in the basement cause it's like really cool down here. Upstairs, it's, uh, it's okay, but all the way upstairs, baby, it go work for me. So anyways, I'm about to go on this busted treadmill that I have. I bought it during COVID. About to get on here for like 45 minutes and then um, fix me some food. So y'all come along on my Monday and uh, yeah. Y'all listen, it's been two months since I had no fast food and all the toxic foods, right? Now, I'm already down about six pounds, which is awesome, just by not eating, you know, toxic and stuff, by eating clean. And uh, we on a roll, we're working out, and all I need is a tiny waist and a big booty. That's all I need. Now, now, Lord, listen, when I was 18, you gave me a little booty. And a little booby, okay? And I was, I was, I was pancake girl in the neighborhood. Now that was a miracle, cause I was really pancake girl. Like I was flat, flat. Like I ain't have nothing. Then 18, the Lord blessed me. Now it's not gonna be too hard for you to give me a tiny tummy and a big old booty. That's all I want. I was a big girl during COVID. I turn this joint off. Hello. I was, I was, I was, I was a big girl during COVID, so I'm trying to get back. But I am, I am grateful for, for the, for the, for the booty. You know, that's the only thing. Now, my stomach isn't all too bad, and I just gotta get these thighs tamed. I don't know what's going on, but, but here we are. We're doing good. We're doing good. 